Well, Warren and Graciela, those flaggers will be redirecting those drivers until tomorrow morning. And while this highway is aimed at safer travels, businesses nearby are hoping it'll mean more customers. A new and improved portion of Highway 180 will have drivers changing lanes Monday evening. It was definitely a, a necessary um, expansion. Caltrans officials have opened a portion of the new Kings Canyon Expressway near Centerville. Hours of traffic control and flaggers will be helping coordinate drivers for the next 12 hours as they transition from the former highway to the newly constructed roadway. We're hoping with the increased capacity that we're going to have softer or wider shoulders at this point. We will have a split median also. Um, so it's two lanes traveling east, two lanes traveling west. That's going to allow for a safer corridor for travelers to head out into the area. This will also mean that traffic will bypass several businesses and shops along the former route. It's the reason Vicki Herkel says she had to move her business, the Centerville Fruit Station, to its new location near Academy and 180. We were kind of forced to find a new location uh, so we would be uh, more visible. So we relocated to this location uh, a year ago. Herkel, however, says the former route was dangerous and this new highway is highly anticipated. She's also hoping that by settling in a busier intersection, business this summer will be a little sweeter. I have a feeling that uh, this summer, when tourist season starts with all of the tourists that uh, travel up to Kings Canyon and Sequoia and the various lakes and mountains and stuff, and the new gas station that opened directly across the street. And I believe that we are going to be a lot busier than, than we have been in the past, and we're really excited about the, the new uh, faces that we'll be seeing this year. While the new roadway is aimed to speed things up, there are still some construction zones, and drivers should expect up to 45-minute delays in those areas. Now, the project is supposed to be fully completed by the fall of this year, and that soft opening is happening right now just a few miles from where we're standing. We'll have more on what drivers need to know before they head this way tonight at 11. For now, live in Fresno County, I'm Natalie Granda, ABC 30 Action News. Thank you for watching. For more videos like this from ABC 30, just make sure to hit that subscribe button below.